It does seem to have been a long winter, and we're only halfway through. During the autumn, I managed to complete some of the Lindley's Garden Railway development bits planned for the winter, but with the bad weather recently and other stuff going on, I just haven't managed to spend enough time outside in the garden recently. There are several bits I'd like to finish off over the next couple of months, and here goes with a description of some of these projects. Hi, I'm Warren Brand, and welcome to another Linley's video. First, back here at Linley's station. I shared a few updates about previous works on this station, but there's a lot more to do. The surface finishes of the platforms need tidying up and also some making good of the faces of the platform edges is needed. At the end of platform 4, the shape is not quite right. The curve needs to be reshaped a bit to reduce the width of the platform a little to ease the curved alignment of the track. The suburban line loops around the back of the garden shed and it needs completely overhauling. Unfortunately, I've used the space as a bit of a dumping ground for materials and a wood store for my wood-burning stove. The track is all there still, but based on a wooden track bed and not the newer concrete method. I need to clear out the rubbish and relay the track bed. With all this new works, I can then include the systems cabling to run the trains fully under the DLC system. Last year, I described how I planned to include a set of station buildings here and lay out a proper station in this area with a signal box, footbridge and other trackside scenery. I don't suppose I'll manage all of that just yet, but I would like to tidy up the groundwork ready for the next stage. I only realised a week or so ago that I've not done as much of the underground ducting works as I thought I had. I need a deep level cable connection route across from this junction point across to the junction hidden under the blue flower pot. I'd only laid part of it under the path and not the whole thing. While I'm concreting other sections, I may decide to complete the track bed along the fence line down here. I replaced the fence panels last year and now it's all ready to finish the job properly. 
I have not run trains along this double main line circuit for a couple of years. It's about time I did. If you are interested in more aspects of the development of Linley's Garden Railway, please take a look at the relevant playlists for the sections of the layout or use one of the link cards at the end of the video here. I've lots more to be getting on with and there'll be more videos to come. Back at Linley Station I should begin the design work for the twin diamond crossovers. I need to make these, I described this junction area in an earlier video. If you have any constructive suggestions or questions please do comment below. Thanks for watching and bye for now.